camping out here tonight. Oh, no, no, no. I'm not taking your bedroom. Yes, you are. It's the most secure room in the house. We've got shades on the windows. It's upstairs. I'll camp out on the couch. No one gets to the stairs without me knowing it. Okay, but just for now, right? Yeah. Okay. So we come up with a way to get you out of this mess. Yeah. So I've been thinking. Um, there's someone who can help. No, no. I'll, uh, I'll take care of that when I get to the station tomorrow. Okay, thanks. Sorry. You said you had someone who might be able to help us? Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking of calling Justin. <laughs> no. Why not? He's an international lawyer. He has experience with legal systems in other countries, especially the Mideast. And... No. He's living at Victor's place. I'm sure he'll be discreet. Two minutes after you say hello to him, Victor will be all over you. Yeah. Do you want that? Considering your history with Victor? I get it. I do. I, I, Victor is... He can a son be... of a bitch. Especially when it comes to you. You don't want to be anywhere near him. Okay, see, I, I think you're just angry because he's letting Hope stay there with your daughter. Yeah. And not doing a damn thing to help her see that she's making a mistake. Hey, you want to ruin your marriage, Hope? Fine. Here, let me help in any way I can. Yeah. Sorry. I am a bit, um, upset with him. But that's got nothing to do with you. Okay. All right. I still think we should call Justin. And I know you well enough to know that if you want to do something, you're going to do it. I want to do this. Okay. Let me make the initial contact and you try to get some sleep tonight, huh? <laughs> Stay out of sight. You got it? I got it. Good. And if you, you know, for some strange reason, get the urge to take a stroll, remember, the Alamanes are after you. They find you. It's over. <laughs>